Hello folks, I'm starting the back of YouTube channel. I'm just starting out. I got a fishing channel called Fishing with Papa Old Dave, if you want to check it out. I just bought me this here solar rotary display. I'm trying to get my camera set up straight and all that, so y'all to bear with me. Hope the lighting's good. I just started collecting die cast mainly uh Hot Wheels, I collected other things. I like gassers and once of course still like gas. And I uh, trying to find super treasure hunts, treasure hunts, you know, IDs, all that. <clears throat> I'm gonna give you a little preview of some stuff I got. These here are older ones that probably I'd say most of them 15, 20 years old. I hope you like it. Like, comment, and subscribe if you want to. Tell me something about these colors and get this straightened out. It's self trim forgive me. We'll get this thing going. Here's a flamed. Pretty nice flame truck. I don't have my glasses on, so I can't tell you when it was cast or anything like that. I hope it's fish and light where you can see. It's pretty nice, and I love these things flames on it. I wonder if this thing will spin faster. There we go. Hopefully my video quality will get better. I'm using my iPhone right now. I'm gonna set up my GoPro 9 later. I mean, that's a nice truck right there. Y'all yeah, see it real good, see it too. It's got hydraulics in the back. This is a preview of some of the stuff I got. I got a high peg hunt. Go to yard sales, flea market, stuff like that. Here's a big old nice Cadillac. It about don't fit on the rotary, rotary here. I'm gonna show he's getting another video and get some better light and stuff. Ain't that nice. That's fun. Another one, like the first one from the Dub series. Probably about 2005, something like that, 2006. I got a lot of loose ones, and card ones. I'll probably crack some of the new ones when I get them to show y'all. Check out that interior. There's your base. The next one is a. It looks like a real old uh, bone shaker, it is. This is probably from the early 2000s. And this one's super nice. It's flamed with an eight ball. On the side, you just darn thing in one. There we go. I mean, that's a nice one. Uh, Y'all agree? Let's go. Older ones seem like they got a lot more detail than new. This will probably come out of a one of those uh, five to a box. A lot of detail. It's our ride too. Hydraulics, I mean. There's a the base. I these don't sell nothing that I collect. I mean, I like to trade. Depending on what somebody's got that I want. Value or rarity, I don't, much, I don't worry too much about that. That's a big old soup bird. That is a nice casting right there. Very nice. The old Dodge Daytona with the blower. Give it a little closer look. There's the base, if anybody's interested. I've got some that about 30 years old. Here's a Boss 429 Mustang. And I believe that's on the Dub Series too. I'm a more of a Chevy man. But I, I got some poles. I hate to have to keep speeding this thing up, but it's cheap Amazon junk. 
He does a job, but a lot of detail in this one. I haven't looked real close, I'm pretty sure it's a dub. Give you a little closer look. The detail. Nice rims. A little bit banged up. There's a base for those interested. Check out them tires on the back. Look at that rubber tires. Now the next one. He's a blown army jeep. Holy detail, part of the bumper's broke off in the nose. You better spin him. Now, what do y'all think of that one? Ain't much on the fantasy cars. I like regular street cars. This is somewhere in between. Super detail. Check it underneath, check the base out. Get its focus. That's a, that's a nice one. I just buy what catches my eye. This next one's called a bullet nose. It's probably from the early 2000s. A lot of detail in it. It's probably from a five pack as well. Give you a little closer look at it. I love anything flames on it. Here's a nice one, people I like. 62 Chevy pickup. Those seem to be one of the hot things right now. I found a whole case of the 53rd anniversary Hot Wheels, and I didn't buy but one set. I should have bought the whole box. It was plum fully 62s. People want them. They custom, customize my love customs. I think that one guy, it's called Hewitt's Hot Wheels. He customized them. I like them. I consider custom an art piece to me. I like to start collecting them. I mean, that's a nice truck of day. All tubbed out, chrome bed. Scallops on the side, slam to the ground. I'll give you a closer look at her. Get her in focus. Some of them's a little beat up, but that's okay. Pretty base. I like the new baby. Especially the ones that are real beat up. I know they've been played with by a kid. This one's called Straight Pipes, probably from, I don't know, 2000, between 2005 to 2000. But you see, it's got flames on it. I love the flames. I'm old school, old grandpa. I wanted to give you a better rubbery display, please. It's a better lighting. It's a nice cast, nice and heavy. Metal base, metal body. And the last one I'm gonna show y'all right now. I just picked a few random ones out to make my first video. Yeah. It's a nice Ford pickup truck, pretty sure it's Ford. Lower to the ground. Nice car, it's a nice casting. Like I said, it seemed like about 15 years ago and before the casting were a lot better. A lot more detail. One mini plastic bases. Hot Wheels does that, Mattel does it to save money, to keep them under a dollar, supposedly. Yep, take a look, good look at this last one. She slammed. 
think it says Suther, Super Smooth on the bottom. That's the name of it. I don't see anything like this on Facebook groups or uh, YouTube channels. Well, that's my preview. Go like, comment, and subscribe if you want to. I'm hoping to make at least one video a week of the diecast to find, which I collect the Hot Wheels mainly, but I'll collect about anything I like. I got my together. Well, I hope you like this video, and I hope you subscribe. Tell your buddies to subscribe, and I will catch y'all cats on the flip side.